house on a Sunday, but I can. I pay bills. I've got my own house. I, if I want to play a game, I'll play a damn game. All right? Don't you judge me for trying to do the campaign. Right, Malachi, <clears throat> a rival allied with Nemesis, is besieging Lord Bramble of Golden Glade. Golden Glade. It matters little who wins that fight, for when we arrive, ultimate victory can only be ours. I want to get to this castle. What's going on? Snapdragon. Oh, Snapdragon. With your usual cunning, you have replaced Keeper Dante as the main Ooh. aggressor to this land. Poor Lord Titus doesn't even know Lord who he Titus. is fighting. Ah. I heard that Dante was driven out by a powerful group of wizards who still guard Snapdragon against the return of any evil forces. Destroying them will make it easier to challenge Lord Titus. Yes, um, it's been, again, it's been a while since I played this, so let's find out. Good leech, I Good bring leech. you tidings glad. My wizards are victorious, and evil Keeper Dante has been driven from this land. Oh, boss. You have done well, my friend Lord Titus. Stay vigilant, and with your wizards guard this realm, lest that foul fiend should threaten you again. Oh, that's a lot from Game of Thrones. Arthur Dane. Stonebridge. Oh, okay. Casino. Ah. Gas trap. Oh, no, not that one. That <laughs> coward keeper Dante now has fled. And so I trust this land to you and give you mission to defeat the Guardian Wizards 5. And then, Lord Titus, prove me right. For evil in its glory must not fail tonight. Your creatures require a place to rest. Build them a lair. What in those monsters there? The stone bridge. Durable and strong, it will cross lava and water. This is quite an interesting one. You need a prison to impound enemy creatures. I ain't got any space. You have claimed a bridge. You have claimed a lair. Yeah, what's interesting here is if they've got no health uh, and you've got a lair and they've not got a bed, they'll take them to there, and which you just saw they quickly created one. Right, so, uh, let's see if we can just get these two just to break this down to get this portal. Oh, there's quite a lot of monsters here. This is, uh, this is a bit of a tricky one. I like it though, a bit challenging. Six men should uh, should go through there. We'll need this hatchery. Actually, I won't do it yet because there's some lads here that don't need a spanker. That one, they're dead. And I am going to need this hatchery as well. <laughs> Imagine that, you just... How did they get there? And, and and why is there a chicken farm there? This implies that they were just sort of like, yeah, yeah, alright, I'll look after the chickens. So they either had to get transported there, and build the chicken farm, and the bridges collapsed around them, and they just stuck there looking at the chickens. Or, it was built around them. Oh no, not these bells. I hate these. You have claimed the poor. These things are the most irritating things ever. Well, I'll pop him here so we can heal, and I'll pop you there so you can take him out. And I'm just going to pop you in your bedroom as well. Yeah, this is kind of an intense one. A new species of creature Ooh, has entered your dungeon. Goblin, amazing. You have claimed that hatchery. Yeah, I don't mind, do they? They're like, yeah, I don't care if I've got no food or drink. I'm still going to come and sort you out. These alarms are really irritating. Really irritating. And it will keep doing this so long as I don't break it. This is why I don't install them. Come on, Salamander. Nope. What's about? And I've not got enough to do one of these. Deluded. Deluded. There we are. 
I'll sort him. <sighs> One thing I do like about goblins, they do turn up. They do turn up to their shift. Oh, thank God we got rid of that damn arm. Okay, I don't think I've lost any of these yet, which is good. Still not got enough for a laser. Not a laser. The other one. Um, lightning. Because you need 6,000 for that. And all the while he's taking out my troops, he's getting leveled up. Well, he's level 3 now. House the Guard, what name? Well done. You, get, you do get some chickens. Go and eat well, lad. Eat well. Okay. These bits here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to build cannons on these two and then sell these bridges so that basically they're, they're protected by a mot of lava, uh, which is always useful. But you have to be careful with funding in this because you've only got so much. Oh, look at all that money. There we are. Um, what can I do? Let's, let's get rid of this magical item. Okay, make all your creatures happy. That's what the casino does. Um, so this thing here, casino's pretty cool. Um, you can, that little dial there, you can use it to either make your troops happy, or you can make money out of them. So if you're low on cash, you can basically mug them. <laughs> and if you've got a spell that raises all their spirits, sorted. Free troops. Yeah, I can't, i got no space. Have I? How am I supposed to do that? One, two, three, four, five. Let's do it. One, two, three, four, five. It's a fear trap. Of course there is. I have no idea I'm going to get to that. Firefly. Yeah, this one's quite an intense level. Skeleton. Those are the ones that you need. Okay, so we've got some dark elves in there on a decent level. Yeah. <laughs> I think they're torturing someone in there. You can tell from the torture screams of agony. It's like, oh gosh, it hurts. Oh, well, fair enough. Fair enough. Do you know what? I'll leave this for now. And then when the spirits get low, I can use that one. Run, Firefly, run! Let's see if I can save her. And then I'm going to put a bridge here. Got to be a bit careful of money, though. Again, I don't really use the eye of uh, haunting the eye of Revelio. Revelio! Because I'm a daredevil. Nothing frightens me. Nothing. Apart from low pixelated trolls that eat chicken. Look at him. Noll the troll. He's happy. Let's keep him away. Give me some chick chick. Hmm. Yeah, they really do keep it tight on this. I could do with a skeleton. If I can get a skeleton just to take that out. 
be able to take that one out. Fear traps, very good against that. Level one earlier. Um, maybe we'll do it a bit. Maybe we find the big guy. God, this door is stubborn. Isn't it? Boys, tell me you're not frightened of a dwarf. Please tell me you're not frightened of a dwarf. This, this is the best kind of uh, best kind of training. It's kind of like a weight training with axes. Treasury. Damn right I have. Not really much else I can do, to be honest. I can slowly work my way through. Oh, payday looks horrible. Payday looks horrible indeed. Mm. You know, I'm going to possession one. Whichever the strongest one is. Um, we've got a strong one over here. It is payday. Salamanders are pretty strong. And that's one of the reasons I did mention why I liked them. And it's because they are similar sort of like they got they got good base stats. They have, the lava thing's a nice feature. Which doesn't make it quite nice. Um, but they've got good strength, they've got good health. Uh, they've got a decent amount of leadership, so they don't get scared straight away. Um, as you can see, they've got decent damage. This is level 3, didn't take too long. This is, you know, a barricade. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, so maybe 7 bites. Yes, yeah, so I've got one. I might just take out all of them just to... <sighs> it's a bit tedious, but... Such is life, isn't it? A lot of this game does involve me doing this sort of thing. And then it will lure him over here. Oh! Ow! If I heal you, will you still be frightened? Don't be frightened. You're a lizard. That's the one thing that's a shame about them, is they are a little cowardly. Come on now. Oh, useless. Absolutely useless. I've just been saying how good they were, and then he goes and runs away. Slightly annoying. enemy creatures. Let's so get this over there. Do you know what? I might just blast Oh, that takes a lot of mana though, doesn't it? Tell you what, I'll even heal you. Well, they don't 
don't really deserve it right now. Yeah, they, they don't have... They're not as cowardly as, as goblins, but they are still not great. Now with these, to stop it going through, you have to surround it, but it's on water, so I'll show you a little trick that you can actually do with this. Uh, and what that is, is we basically surround it like that. And it should. A new there we go. Of Takes care of it. Your what have we got? Oh, Dark Elf, hello. Yeah, I could do it with Dark Elf. We're taking over an enemy room. You get better doors as well, so you've got this typical standard door, and then as they build up, so you've got like reinforced secret doors are quite interesting. The casino. Ooh. The most useful room. Use the lever in the center to adjust its function. Either you charm your creatures by allowing them to win, or let them gamble their wages directly back into your coffers. Love that word. Coffers. I have a bit of OCD, so I kind of like to get rid of these things. Your creatures are unable to get to a lair. No, they're not. Unless. No, it's fine. Wait, are they trapped? Where'd they be trapped? They can't be trapped. Oh, did one of them get stuck underneath the door or something? Very much like you to attack these, please. Then you can get to training. And in return, I shall try and heal some of you up. Uh, yeah, go on in. Once we've done that, we can then get to jumping around. Lazy slugs. Yeah, once they do that as well, these walls will, should do. Mm. This is quite interesting because it's uh, a lot less like. Um... Yeah, so I think this is why we have the casino. Because there's limited gold. Mm. And because we've got this spell that makes them happy. Oh, it's over here, isn't it? Once we've got the spell that makes them happy, we can basically rob them. And then before they're all mutiny, we'll send them on their way. A new species of creature has entered your dungeon. Well, I've already got some under. You see these beds here as well. Uh, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. So that will give us 20. So it is possible that we can get rid of some of these. God, these lads aren't tough, are they? Go on then, let's get you some chick chick. Deep fried chicken. Mm. It's not deep fried. Don't need to be deep fried. Yeah, it's all hard rock. Hard rock, hallelujah. Right? Very hostile land. Interesting, though. I appreciate if If you are watching this, by the way, um, and you're enjoying it, obviously I don't want to say the thing of only like it if you want to. I'm just doing this for me, but if you enjoy it, that's great. And I do appreciate you watching it because that tells me that you are enjoying the, uh, the video. Right, so right now, these uh, imps, they will not mine if their pockets are full. So just to speed things along, again, micromanaging. Your minions need a larger training room. Bang like that, and then you can actually manually pick up the gold, sort of drop it near where it is. Oh, they're telling me as if I need a large train room, as if I've got strength over this. So what we're going to do is... That should. Once they break this... I'm going to drop one. He's going to get the casino <laughs> where there's a single roulette table. <laughs> it's a dungeon there. 
I'd go. That ale looks quite nice. As soon as it's rigged, though. And these guys are too stupid. That's right, Goblin, I'm talking about you. You're too stupid. Look at that pixelated hand. I remember when I ever played this game. Alright, so, one, two. One, two. One. Two, three. Uh, I'm gonna rob them. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna rob them. Rob them blind. I don't respect them. I need to keep this troll safe. Ah, the rogue <laughs> is Prince of Thieves. He is talented at forcing entry and when possessed can walk unseen. That's interesting. As I say, I've not played this for about ten years. That's not even an exaggeration. It looks like a base boy. Baseball boy. Come on, sport, let's play some ball. Yeah. The rogue. Stone gore. It's got an old bed. Look at that. Sleeps in an old bed. I always thought these goblin ones always look kinda cozy. Don't sleep in the egg or anything. The Iron Maid. As if they don't have to make some. Yeah. They are strong. They are strong. Mm. Yeah, look after the troll in this one. Ooh, go away! Um. Yeah, that's it. Well done. Well done, Hornet. Now look what you've done. Now look what you've done. In fact, Hornet's gonna fight him now for that. for it. I wonder why they're going for it. It's supposed to scare, maybe it can only scare off so many at a time. These goblins are actually going for this. Maybe they're blood drunk. Amazing. Amazing. Actually amazing. I, I'm really impressed with that. They actually just went for it, didn't they? You saw that, didn't you? That I'm gonna have to get rid of it just because it's so annoying. Maybe that's his plan. Come here, come here, come on, stand on the wood. Imagine how many skeletons I would have. A rogue has become unhappy because he has no lair. Is there nowhere to put a bed on there? You can put a bed there, lad. In fact, I might just put some beds around. Anywhere else? Is there any actual land? Don't make it easy, do they? I don't want to put beds around here because it's so open. I kind of need that prison. I think they're a bit redundant as well. Build a bigger hatchery to keep your creatures well fed. How am I supposed to? I can't build anything. Oh, hello. Giant can, the others can't. 
I'm going to show you a nasty trick you can do. So I'm going to pop these lads over here. And what's going to happen is, if you can build a bridge across, and as they walk across you can then sell it. And what that does... Oh god, they killed my dark elf. Zap him. There you are. Yes, they can't come across. I might keep it this way. Hold on, let's... Right, they all become unhappy, aren't they? I've got one unhappy rogue. Why is he unhappy? He's got no bed. Your lair is too small. Um, oh, a rogue has become angry because he has no lair. There's your bed. Bed's there, lad. That's the best I can do. They're not too bad. I don't think I need to use them yet. I do want to keep him though. So maybe save my dark elf, please. I think over here as well. You have claimed a hatchery. Good, good. Eat chicken. You know what? I'm gonna possess him just to, just to get the land. He's running all the way to the other side of the map just to just to plant the gold. This can be where they sleep. So this is another bedroom for him. Uh, I want to see if I can do this. Go on, come over, I dare you. That's it. You should come Your hatchery is under attack. Sell it before they can do too much damage. Come on, Ed. Come on over. Come on. Come on. Whoops. <laughs> Doesn't do much damage, but it does some. Jesus, these things are tough. The hornet to impound enemy creatures. I'm uh, I'm just gonna leave these guys to go back to the bedroom, and then I'll put another hatchery there. Your minions need a larger training room. Oh, they're quite ungrateful, aren't they? I'm gonna possess one. Clear the way. That might hurt them. I hope not. Swell pits, what a name. A salamander has become unhappy because it hasn't been paid. Which salamander? There's money right here. Go take some. is starving in your prison. Can't zap anyone, I suppose it's a good sign. Mm, nice little vein there. And it feeds over to here. Nice. Some more imps. 
claim the bridge. Try and get rid of uh, hero gates if you can. So I'm actually just gonna pop these lads here because I really need them to get rid of this. And once that's popped up, there you go, destroyed. You've taken over an enemy room. Your prison is too small. Just give him a single zap. There you go. That will keep him. Half health. Come on, boys. There you go, good lads. There's chicken right there. I'm trying to think. Oh, what's he doing here? Where does they come from? Your dungeon heart is under attack. Oh. A creature has died in your prison and has risen as a skeleton. You have claimed a bridge. You have taken over an enemy room. If you don't mind, saving me, please. Good, thank you. to select them all. A dark elf has become unhappy because she has no red. Right, come on, boys. Some out. Your creatures have been made happy. There you go. Let's make them all happy. Should you have go. successfully converted an enemy creature in the torture chamber. I don't remember. Why is she... There you go. Your mana reserves have been increased. Let's see if I can get rid of this hero gate. He's got rid of that. It'll be GG's. There we go. Yeah, get rid of the hero gates. You've taken over an enemy room. So, although I've, I have got a workshop, but you see these there, that means that they don't need to be built. So, once I've claimed them, I can start putting the mows around, uh, which is nice. Oh, I do need some more. Oh, they're dead. Yeah, and because it's all linear, it's taken a significant amount of time to get any mana. Which, um, I suppose that's kind of the point, isn't it? Is there anything else I can go around to calm up? Do. Oh, yes, hello. It just makes it dark as well. Again, sometimes you need 
to, because otherwise I'll just walk around giving you money thinking that's what you want. Cool, so we got that. I might just... They'll, they'll get this eventually. Has become unhappy because she has no she's got no bed either. Um... Uh. A creature has died in your prison and has risen as a skeleton. You have claimed a library. Mm. Should attract. Ah. Okay. Um. I'm not gonna actually. No, I'm not going for that yet. I have got horny though. Should we go for it. Your creatures have been blessed with experience. Like that one. Instant health. Go on, just chip away. Ugh. Your minions need a larger training room. I ain't got the space, have I? Yeah, I'm gonna plant Horny there, but he's gonna tear through them. Even though there's all this map. See what else is around over here. Okay, not much. Get chipping. There you go. Casino is too small. Don't give over. It's only a level one. Come on, Smirch. Got my money going down. Oh yeah, it's probably from the training room. I'm assuming they have to pay for new straw. A new species of creature has entered your dungeon. So you spent about 30 minutes trying to get all this ready. It's taking a little while, isn't it? So far, two minutes. There we go. There you go. If horny becomes too much for you to handle, a single slap will expel him from your domain. Come on, Horny. Sum out, lad. Your dark designs will never succeed while I still draw breath. Swell pit one. There we go. Horny saves the day. Now he di <laughs> So he disappears to respawn. And he does his nice moonwalk. Collects the gem. And is happy. God, that was quite a tough level, that. Look, his face is distorted as well. Bless him. If anyone got a tattoo of him, establish like, patrol routes with the guard. Braced yeah. doors boast a tougher, smarter design. Mm. So I think the guard post is quite good for um, if you essentially want to make it a bit more automated, so they can sort of do routes. Divided attention. <laughs> Is that PVC? Probably would be its lightest. Oh my! 
<laughs> Dirty bugger. God, I hate bottle well tails. They're so lazy. Keeper. Good at health. Even though. the horny was impressed with this victory. Mm, you assembled be. a mighty contingent of many creatures and used your limited resource as well. Mm. The <sighs> land of Sparkly Dell has found itself to be the object of Keeper Morgana's desires. We must keep a close eye on the outcome of that battle. It could prove rather interesting. So I don't think what you can do can influence the rest of the map. Um, obviously that's the last level. Um, I think soon we will get to meet other keepers. So in the minute we just find the Lord of Light, but eventually we will get to meet other keepers, which are basically other dodgy keepers like you, with the same troops and everything. They're just different colours, like yellow, green and blue. But yes, thank you very much for watching.